Hi everyone, Pablo, your friendly local Madison Mazda service guy. I wanted to reach out with some key winter tips. One of the most important is your car battery, which is under the hood or could be in the trunk, depending on which Mazda you drive. During the cold, batteries have a tendency to act up and they don't always have the right reserve capacity to actually start your car. So key thing is make sure you get your battery tested to make sure you have enough reserve capacity and your state of health of your battery is good and your state of charge is good. The other one is make sure you have the right battery sized for the vehicle so you don't get left stranded. You wanna be able to start your car at every time. Another thing I wanna reach out and talk to you guys about is gonna be tires and tire pressures. A lot of times in the morning when it's cold, you get that pesky tire light up here on your dashboard. That's due to tire pressures dropping because of the cold weather. So if you see that light come on, come on by so we can actually fill up and air up those tires to the right pressure. You always want them to be around 32 to 35 PSI. Another thing is make sure you have your right tires on your car. A summer tire could leak, create some problems for you down the road. So you wanna make sure you're running a nice all season tire or even a winter tire. That seems to be the, one of the popular things we're doing in the shop right now is mounting and balancing your winter tires. And we can get that done for 99.95. And then lastly, the last thing we wanna talk about is washer fluid. You wanna make sure you change from your summer blend to your winter blend. Winter blend washer fluid will hold up longer in the cold. It has a higher alcohol content and that will prevent anything from freezing. So as long as you got your right washer blend, you can get everything going and be safe out there in the winter. Just some friendly tips from your local Mazda store. You guys stay safe out there and stay warm and be safe. Thank you.